tonight, we follow the routine shift of the cinema staff member to determine what drives such dedicated employees to run the many multiplexes around our cities and try and shine a light on why anyone would want to be a multifunctional. It is the beginning of the shift. But to test the multifunctional's nerve, the management have chosen to lock this staff member outside for the next two days to see if he's worthy. Once inside, staff members are contracted to iron their uniform. All of it. The staff are split up and put on different areas. This staff member is on bin duty and must sit and guard the bins so no one steals them. Some employees are also asked to clean out the bins. This involves taking the rubbish out first, climbing in the bin, cleaning the inside and then replacing the rubbish. So the employees can't escape once they sign a contract with the cinema. They are locked in a cupboard after every shift and then taken out as and when the management see fit. Once on the station, it is imperative the staff member stays put for the full length of the shift before returning to the cupboard. To keep employees vigilant, the door codes are changed every 10 minutes to lower the risk of customers accidentally walking into private areas. But some areas, such as projection, are even out of bounds for the multifunctionals and management. Yes? Uh, the IP box? What? Oh, no, 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 leave that alone. Hello? Uh, down the vent here. Hello? Hey? Hey, uh, yeah, uh, it's, it's Lee. Uh, I'm stuck in the sluice room again. A multifunctional's attention span is often quite short. This is due to the tedious information that is of no use drilled into them as part of the strict training program, armed to improve customer service, working relations and health and safety. One of these aspects is fire evacuation, which they must commit to memory. All staff members are then able to be calm and collected during any moments of terror or deep peril. Selling is always an encouraged skill that all employees are taught. Even faced with a tough customer, a good multifunctional can always deliver the hard sell. Uh, Bex, please. Bex. Um, well, at the moment, we have a special offer. We've got two boxes of magnet for £5. If you would be interested. Nah, just, just the best. It is break time, and all multifunctionals have a set menu for their one meal of the day. The Colonel's secret recipe of 14 herbs and spices is sometimes hard to stomach for new starters, with the trace elements of grass, fag ash and pedigree chum infused in the tasty chicken. Over the weeks and months, they will gradually become accustomed to such foul-tasting muck and eventually become dependent on it. Um, well, we, the special is very good because um, as you can see, the, the, the magnet bottles are bigger, so you're getting your money's worth. It's £3 for a bottle of Bex, when it's £5 for two large bottles of Magnum. I don't like Magnus, no, just, just the Bex, please. The bond between managers and multifunctionals is one of a mutual respect and admiration. They are quick to voice their appreciation for the other one's efforts. Fucking disgrace. That's disgusting. <laughs> um, that they should all be shot on sight. Lock them to a chair and piss on them. Discrimination. It's <laughs> disgusting. Sick. They actually make me want to vomit on my own <laughs> leg. I definitely don't agree with any of that whatsoever. Don't have a clue. Uh, they can't even run a building. Should have resorted to lethal injection. <laughs> no. 
I dream of the day I become one, find one, marry one, be lady what lunch is. That's about it really. Shouldn't be allowed to live. To keep multifunctionals entertained during a long shift, the management always comes up with new ways to keep them busy. Tanya, yeah. you do me a favour today, please. Yeah. Uh, I want you to do anything here to reorganise all the suites for me. But I need you to do it so that they're in organisation by colour. Okay, that's fine. Yeah? Yeah, sure, thanks. Have you seen had magnets before? Well, uh, why don't you give it a shot? First time for everything, eh? Two bottles, no, just, two just, bottles, five pounds. Think about it. Uh, think, no, no think, just, just think about it. Stop, stop for a second and think about it. There has been a noticeable drop in the stock of popcorn, which means only one thing. They must call upon a man with no fear, no memory of who or what he is, no name, and no work permit within the EU. Yet he is known to all as the popper. Within an hour, the stock is back up to the suitable level and he returns to his living quarters behind the screen in Auditorium 8. Two bottles, five pounds. Yeah? No, it's the best thing. No, really, no. Think, if you, just have, a think, have, a best. have a think about it's it. It's the best thing. Look. What's this? Look. Two bottles, uh, two bottles, five pounds. What do you think? Just think about it. Just really, just stop and think about it. Think that, and if you do this, right, I've got a possibility of getting some HMB tokens at the staff meeting. If I sell loads, and I really want to sell some, so come on, please. Ah! Just stop whinging and buy a bottle of... Go. Okay, all right. Two bottles of Magna. Yeah, 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 fine. Yeah, 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 let me go. Okay. Oh. Two bottles of Magna, yeah? Yeah. No. Cool. I'm sorry, the bar's closed at the moment. <laughs> Thanks to the multifunctionals, the cinema has a good reputation and high standard to uphold, having a close relationship and rapport with the local press. The delight of doing pick and mix or bin duty is always a close contest, with multifunctionals often left to decide for themselves where to do the next eight hour shift. Fuck's sake! Pick and mix. One, two, three. Finally, one multifunctional is pushed to breaking point and decides to take matters into his own hands. I can't work under these conditions! Right! I can't do this anymore! Right! His actions caused much confusion, and in the end, some of his closest colleagues put a stop to his madness and grass him up to the management. There we are. I got him! I got him! Someone call the police! Let me out of here! Crazy bastard! I don't want to work here anymore! Since this film was aired, the multifunctional in question has been reprimanded taken to a disclosed location, shot and buried in an unmarked grave. The job of a multifunctional is a rewarding one, with one day of the prospect of being allowed to see a film. Many people apply when the new position becomes available every two weeks. With the pride of being part of an elite team, it's fun to be a multifunctional. Quality is the best thing going. More exciting than anything else in my life. <laughs> you want to go? No, <laughs> Next time on Cinema, we open the door on the projectionist and take a closer look at the hidden work of the people who show dedication, dependency, madness, booth dementia, and paranoia.
claustrophobic man here. Uh, can I have some help, please? Anyone at all, please. Hello? 